Porcupines hold the title of the third largest rodents, dwarfed only by capybaras and beavers. Their size is not just for show, it plays a crucial role in their survival strategy, allowing them to fend off predators with their intimidating presence, complemented by their unique defense mechanism, a coat of sharp quills. Diving into the diversity of porcupines, we find two main types, the Old World porcupines of Europe, Asia, and Africa and the New World porcupines found in North and South America. This geographic split highlights the adaptability and evolutionary success of porcupines, allowing them to thrive across various continents and climates. The sharp quills that adorn porcupines are more than just a fearsome exterior, they serve as a formidable defense against predators. These quills are hardened hair made of keratin, which is the same protein that makes up human hair and nails, showcasing nature's ingenuity in repurposing materials for survival. A common misconception about porcupines is their ability to shoot their quills at threats. In reality, porcupines cannot project their quills but have evolved them to detach easily upon contact. This ensures that any animal foolish enough to attack gets a painful reminder to keep its distance in the future. Porcupines are creatures of the night, embracing a nocturnal lifestyle that serves multiple purposes. This behavior allows them to search for food with reduced competition and threat from diurnal predators. Additionally, it helps them conserve water, an essential survival tactic in some of the arid environments they inhabit. Porcupines are predominantly nocturnal animals, meaning they are most active during the night. This behavior helps them avoid many predators and allows them to search for food with less competition from other animals. The cover of darkness provides an added layer of protection as they navigate through their habitat. Their unique coat of sharp quills serves as their primary defense mechanism against predators. These quills are not just any hair but are hardened with keratin, making them incredibly tough. Contrary to popular belief, porcupines cannot shoot their quills, but the quills detach easily and can become embedded in the skin of any animal that tries to attack them. Being excellent climbers, porcupines have adapted to life both on the ground and in the trees. They often climb trees to escape predators or to find food, showcasing their agility and strength. This ability to climb helps them access a wider variety of food sources, including leaves and fruits that are out of reach for many other ground-dwelling animals. Their diet is quite varied, encompassing leaves, twigs, fruits, and occasionally, small vertebrates. This dietary flexibility helps porcupines survive in a range of environments, from forests to grasslands. By consuming a wide array of plant material, they play a crucial role in their ecosystems, helping to control vegetation and disperse seeds. Porcupines reproduce at a slow rate, typically giving birth to a single offspring, known as a porcupet. These porcupets are born with soft quills that harden within a few days, providing them with immediate protection from predators. The slow reproduction rate is balanced by the porcupine's long lifespan, with some species living up to 15 years in the wild. Baby porcupines, or porcupets, enter the world equipped with soft quills. These quills are a marvel of nature, undergoing a rapid transformation to harden within days after birth. This process is vital for their survival, offering them a defense mechanism that steadily prepares them to face the wild's dangers. Porcupines are creatures of solitude, preferring the company of their own kind only during mating seasons. This solitary nature underlines their survival strategy, minimizing conflicts and competition for resources. Their interactions are brief, centered around reproduction, ensuring the continuance of their species with minimal social complexities. These nocturnal animals boast an impressive lifespan, especially for members of the rodent family. Living up to 15 years, porcupines showcase resilience and adaptability in their natural habitats. Their longevity is a testament to their effective defense mechanisms and cautious lifestyle, navigating the dangers of the wild with sagacity. Despite their limited vision, porcupines have developed an exceptional sense of smell. This compensatory adaptation allows them to navigate their environment, find food, and detect predators or potential mates. Their reliance on olfactory cues exemplifies nature's ability to equip creatures with the necessary tools for survival and reproduction. In various cultures, porcupine quills hold significant value, utilized in decorations and traditional ceremonies. 
This practice highlights the deep connection between humans and the natural world, where even the defenses of a solitary animal can be repurposed into objects of beauty and cultural significance. Porcupines, thus, contribute to the tapestry of human tradition beyond their immediate ecological role. Porcupine quills have long fascinated scientists for their unique properties, finding a place in the realm of traditional medicine. Their structure and composition make them ideal for use as needles, offering a natural solution that has been tapped into for generations. This innovative application showcases the intersection of nature and science, where animal adaptations inspire medical advancements. The name of porcupine itself evokes a certain imagery, derived from the Middle French word pork espin, translating to a spined pig. This moniker perfectly encapsulates the essence of these creatures, highlighting their most distinctive feature, the quills. It's a nod to their rugged appearance and the defensive armor that sets them apart in the animal kingdom. Porcupines pose a unique challenge to human infrastructure, particularly wooden structures and trees. Their gnawing habits, driven by the need to wear down continuously growing teeth, can cause significant damage. This behavior underscores the conflict between wildlife and human interests, where the natural instincts of animals clash with human endeavors. In the wild, porcupines face threats from predators like wolves, mountain lions, and great horned owls. Despite their formidable quill armor, these animals are not invincible. The dynamics of predator and prey play out in their daily survival, showcasing the delicate balance within ecosystems where each species plays a crucial role. The design of porcupine quills includes a barely visible black tip, a subtle but critical part of their defense mechanism. This coloration can serve as camouflage in the dark, making it harder for predators to spot the quill's sharp ends. It's a testament to the evolutionary adaptations that have enabled porcupines to thrive in their natural habitats. Porcupines, contrary to the clumsy image they might conjure, are adept swimmers. This aquatic ability is an unexpected facet of their survival skills, allowing them to escape predators and explore new habitats. Their buoyancy is aided by their hollow quills, making water an ally in their quest for safety and sustenance. The unique defense mechanism of porcupines, where they shake their quills to create a rattling sound, serves as a stark warning to potential predators. This sound signals danger, deterring attacks before they happen. It's a non-violent way for porcupines to assert their boundaries and protect themselves without resorting to their quills. The African crested porcupine holds the title of the largest species among its kind, showcasing an impressive array of long, robust quills. This particular species embodies the pinnacle of porcupine evolution, with its size and quill length serving as formidable deterrents against the majority of would-be predators. Porcupines carry an unexpected form of protection beyond their sharp quills, an antibiotic in their skin. This natural antibiotic ensures that when porcupines accidentally quill themselves, the wounds don't become infected. It's a remarkable adaptation that minimizes the risk of self-injury in their spiny existence. Humans have found various uses for porcupine quills throughout history, from tools to ornaments. These quills, once serving as defense mechanisms in the wild, have been repurposed into decorative items and utility tools, showcasing the ingenuity of human craftsmanship. This tradition highlights a unique intersection between nature's designs and human creativity. Porcupines have a unique dietary habit that may surprise many, they consume bones. This unusual practice allows them to supplement their diet with essential minerals, particularly calcium, which is crucial for maintaining their robust quills and overall skeletal health. This behavior showcases their adaptability and resourcefulness in the wild. The greasy coating found on porcupine quills serves a dual purpose. Not only does it facilitate easier penetration into the skin of potential predators, but it also plays a significant role in preventing infections. This natural lubrication ensures that even when porcupines accidentally quill themselves, the risk of wound infection remains low. In North America, the porcupine stands out among rodents for its unique defense mechanism. Its quills are not only sharp but also coated with an antibiotic layer. This adaptation is particularly beneficial, reducing the chances of infection after an encounter with predators or during accidental self-quilling incidents. Porcupines exhibit remarkable arboreal abilities, climbing trees with ease. 
This skill is not just for foraging but also serves as a strategic move to evade ground predators. Some species even make trees their homes, constructing nests among the branches to sleep and raise their young in relative safety. The gestation period of a porcupine lasts about seven months, a considerable length of time compared to other rodents. This extended pregnancy culminates in the birth of usually a single offspring, known as a porcupet. The slow reproduction rate highlights the importance of each new generation for the survival of the species. Porcupines are equipped with a thick skin that acts as a protective barrier beneath their formidable coat of quills. This layer is crucial for their survival, offering additional defense against the punctures of their own quills and external threats. It's an evolutionary trait that underscores the porcupine's resilience in the wild. During the cold winter months, porcupines enter a period of reduced activity but do not hibernate. This adaptation allows them to conserve energy without the need for a complete shutdown. They rely on their fat reserves and occasional foraging to make it through the season, demonstrating their capability to endure harsh conditions. The tail quills of some porcupine species serve as a unique defensive tool. These quills can be rattled as a warning to potential predators, creating a sound that signifies danger. This auditory signal is an effective first line of defense, often deterring threats before they escalate to physical confrontation. In certain regions, porcupines are viewed as pests due to their taste for cultivated crops. Their feeding habits can lead to significant agricultural damage, causing frustration for farmers and gardeners. This conflict highlights the challenges of coexistence between porcupines and human populations, as their natural behaviors intersect with economic interests. The quill release mechanism of porcupines has not only protected them in the wild but also inspired advancements in medical technology. Researchers have looked to the ease with which porcupine quills penetrate and detach to develop painless needles. This is a prime example of how nature's designs can lead to innovative solutions in human healthcare. Despite their formidable defense system, porcupines are not invincible. Skilled predators like fishers and lynxes have adapted strategies to circumvent the quills, targeting the porcupine's vulnerable face or flipping them over to attack the quill-less belly. This natural balance highlights the adaptability and prowess of these hunters in the wild. Porcupines inhabit a wide range of environments, from arid deserts to lush forests, showcasing their remarkable adaptability. These environments offer various challenges, from extreme temperatures to diverse predators, yet porcupines thrive by foraging for food at night and seeking shelter during the day, demonstrating their resilience and versatility. Communication among porcupines is surprisingly rich, involving an array of sounds from grunts and whines to screams. These vocalizations play a crucial role in their social interactions, particularly during mating season or when expressing distress. This auditory communication complements their physical defense, adding depth to their social behaviors. The unique foot structure of porcupines, equipped with skidproof pads, facilitates their remarkable climbing abilities. This adaptation allows them to escape predators and access food sources like tree bark, leaves, and fruits. Their agile climbing not only showcases their evolutionary ingenuity but also highlights their ability to navigate complex terrains with ease. Conservation efforts for porcupines vary widely, with some species facing threats from habitat loss and hunting. Protecting these unique creatures requires a nuanced understanding of their ecological role and the challenges they face. Ensuring their survival not only benefits porcupines but also maintains the biodiversity and health of their ecosystems.